here with my beautifully stunning roommates, Dion and Sienna. And we're going to make this cast off group video together because all of us knit. And this is our last um, few days in the house together. Because we're all leaving, which is really sad. And I'm going to miss them a lot. So I figured, why the shit shouldn't we do a video together? Why the shit indeed. Yes. Um, so I will let Sienna go first on the shit note. <laughs> so this is a sweater that I knitted. Um, I'm an art major and environmental studies double major. So um, it, it reads dead and defecated matters on it. Um, and I have some pretty patterns in the back. Um, and it's all wool. Olivia actually gave me this brown wool at one point. It's very much appreciated. So that's that. Okay, Dion. All right, and I am working on a blanket. I'm hoping for a while now, but not as long as I would have thought. <laughs> ah, it's a monster! Well, oh, sorry, no, it's I hit okay. you in the head. It's okay. It wouldn't be the first time you've hit me. Oh, no! What? <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding, but mostly not. Who it knows? hit her with just a kidding. shirt today. That yeah, she did hit violent. me just a few minutes ago, actually. Yeah, so maybe you're you're not so innocent. But so who is the blanket for? It is for one of my good friends. How nice of you. Um, I have one finished object this week, which is this hat, which I'm very happy with. I knit this when I should have been studying for some of my finals. And I made it with this yarn. If you could identify this yarn, I would be really appreciative. It's an acrylic. I can tell from feeling it. It's a worsted weight, I'd say. Um, I got it in a mill end bag at Joann's that was originally priced $7.99 for four skeins of this mystery yarn. And I thought it was really pretty colors. So I bought it. And then when I got it to the register, she said, your total is three fifty, dollars and I was confused because I had given her my student discount, and I was like, that's only 10%, it shouldn't be that cheap, but it was already 50% off. So I got a crazy good deal, and so now I will be making a lot of hats with it, I'm sure. And this blanket that I'm working on is almost done. So this is what it's looking like so far. I just have... I'm almost done with this row, and then I have one more square row that I'd like to do, and then I will be finishing this thing with an I-cord edge. Yeah, that's interesting. Um, this yarn that I use for this blanket and the yarn Dion used is the same, but hers is almost, almost coarse feeling for, for an acrylic. This almost feels like Red Heart Super Saver to me. Is it is that not quite that there? bad. I'm not saying it's that bad, but it feels on that level. And this is really soft, and it's the same brand of Knit Picks Brava, just different colors, so it's kind of interesting that they feel so different. Because pretty much, how many of your skeins felt like this? Probably almost all of them, right? You had maybe uh, one or there two? There were a few that didn't. She had a couple that didn't feel like that, but most of them aren't very soft. So I'm kind of wondering what's going on there, because Knit Picks usually is pretty consistent, and their yarns are nice, but I don't know. So that was kind of a weird thing. It'll wash, you know, whatever. It'll come out, but it's just kind of a weird thing that we noticed. Because I told her, buy this yarn, it's so soft and nice, it'll be great for making this blanket. And then hers wasn't <laughs> that nice, so. Bummer. Bummer. And that's really all we've got to share with you guys this week. Um, I will check you all next time. Make sure to look in the description box below for the links to the other cast off crew members. If you're interested in joining the cast off crew, if you've been watching for a while and you're thinking, hmm, I should do this, email Laura the Crochet Zombie and she'll get you set up. Or I think she also goes by the Artistic Pagan. So I, either of those, I don't know which one she's using. I think the Artistic Pagan maybe is the one you should look for on YouTube. And then you can message her and she'll get you set up. So that is everything. Bye guys! Bye!